one of the questions we hear often is, how do I choose solar panels for my boat? Common question, right? Uh, solar is a great solution for boaters to charge and maintain the batteries in sunny conditions or partially cloudy. Even a small solar array can be a perfect solution to add a few days uh, or even an extra day or two without running the generator, right? It's not a gimmick. Solar definitely works. I've got solar on my boat and uh, very happy. To design a solar system that best suits your boat, you've got to do a little bit of homework. So a little bit of homework means a few little questions. What's the size of your battery bank? Uh, how many daily amp hours of capacity do you use? Do you want to have solar to offset the refrigeration loads? Or maybe you want to stay an extra day in Anchorage. Or maybe you want to stay at Anchorage indefinitely, some of my clients do, uh, from solar. All of those, your objectives are definitely going to influence the array. Do you want, are you thinking about monocrystalline or polycrystalline panels, right? Some are less efficient, more efficient than others. More efficient obviously needs more money. Are you looking for flexible, semi-flexible or rigid panels? Um, and then you've got to also consider your controller. What kind of controller are you going to get? Because not all controllers work for all panels. Specific controllers for specific panels or specific solar arrays, right? Are you going to wire your solar panels in series or are you going to wire them in parallel? Again, that depends on your setup. And where will you install those solar panels? Are they going to be installed in the Bimini? Are they going to have shading? Are they going to be on an arch? Are they going to be on the railings? Are they going to be on a coach roof? There's some people mounting solar panels on the deck. Um, some are mounting, mounting them on canvas. Some are mounting them, like I said, um, I've seen some people mount them with offsets, with stainless steel offsets off the coach roof. It really depends. There's a lot of different ways. To have all of this legwork and these choices uh, thought for you, uh, we've put together a downloadable PDF that is available on our website. And the link is below at pysystems.com. We love to share our knowledge and hope that this document will give you the tools you need to make an informed decision about choosing a solar array for your boat. Thanks. If you're curious, we've written whole articles about this. Go on our website, search it out. Uh, and we've got a lot of other uh, tech talks about this very topic. If you haven't subscribed to this channel, please do. Um, it actually, it really does make a difference. It encourages us to keep posting. So if you're watching this video and haven't had a chance to subscribe, we really do care because the more of you that are watching, the more of us over here are willing to put, spend more time in creating content. So thanks again.